Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to see the construction of voltmeter using the basic DR Sonval meter. In the previous lectures, we have seen how to construct the ammeter for single range and multi range. In multi range also, we have seen two different types. One is a shunt type, another one is series type. Series type is nothing but R written shunt. Okay, how we have constructed the ammeter? The basic meter comes in parallel with the shunt resistance comes in parallel with the resistance that means a resistor is connected across the meter then it that type of construction is known as ammeter but just opposite is the case with the voltmeter we have to we have to connect a resistor in series with the meter we have to connect a resistor in series with the meter that type of arrangement is known as voltmeter see this is the series resistor rs is nothing but series resistor rs or rse both are same <coughs> series resistor rs or rse and this resistor is connected in series with the meter see this is the meter this is the symbolic representation of the meter as we have discussed in the previous case the meter is same but instead of a shunt resistor as in the case of a meter here we have used a resistor which is connected in series Okay, the name of this resistor is series resistor or more generally known as multiplier resistor. Multiplier resistor. This is the unknown input voltage we are applying between these two terminals here. So, IM is nothing but already we know IM is nothing but meter current or full scale reflection current of the moment IFST. And internal resistance of the meter RM is nothing but internal resistance. RS is the multiplier resistance, as I said. And V is nothing but full range voltage of the instrument. Full range voltage of the instrument. Coming to calculation of multiplier resistance. In the previous case, in the calculation of ammeter, we have calculated RSH value. RSH value. How we have calculated the RSH value? RSH we have calculated in the case of ammeter in terms of the current I and internal current flowing through the meter and as well as meter resistance RM. Okay, if you remember the formula was IM RM by I minus IM. This is RSH formula. Okay, in the similar way, here also we are going to find out the series resistance or multiplier resistor value for voltmeter. Okay, very very easy. So see, take the same circuit diagram, same circuit diagram. Just write the equation. How you are going to write the equation for V? Entire circuit voltage is V. And the entire current flowing through the meter is IM. And what is the total resistance of the circuit? This is series resistance RS plus RM. So V is equal to IM into RS plus RM. See, so V is equal to IM into RS plus RM. So simply you can manipulate the equation so that you can get the RS as rs is equal to v by im minus rm very 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 important rs is equal to v by im minus rm here also you have calculated the rs in terms of it is a function of v im rm see here rsh is calculated as a function of i im rm but here rs is calculated as a function of v im RM. Okay, IM RM, these values are same in both the cases, but in the case of voltmeter, the unknown voltage V here, and in the case of ammeter, the unknown current I is here. Hope you understand the difference between the shunt resistance and the series resistance or multiplier resistance calculation. Let us do a small example problem on this one. So a basic TR Sonval moment 
with a full scale reflection current of 50 microamperes. That means IM value is given an internal resistance of 500 ohms. Internal resistance of 500 ohms is used as a DC voltmeter. Determine the value of multiplier resistance required to measure the voltage range of 0 to 10 volts. Let us write the values which are given here. IM is given. What is IM? That is 50 microamperes. 50 into 10 power minus 6. And RM is given. RM is equal to 500 ohms. Writing the given values is very very important to understand the values. <coughs> what, what are the given values and what we need to find out. The voltage range is given. That means it is a single range. So V is equal to 10 volts. Maximum part we need to take. 0 to 10 volts range is given. 0 to 10 volts but we need to take 10 as the range. Maximum voltage. Now we are asked to calculate what is the series resistance or multiplier resistance value. As we have seen in the previous slide, RS is equal to V by IM minus RM. V by IM minus RM. So what is the V here? 10 by IM. 50 micro means 50 into 10 power minus 6 minus rm 500 ohms so 0 0 1 by 5 0 0.2 into 10 power 6 minus 500 so if you simplify this one 200 into 0 0 <coughs> so 200 kilo minus 0 0.5 kilo it is 199.5 kilo ohms. Okay, 199.5 kilo ohms because the first value is 200 kilo. It will become 200 kilo and it becomes so 0.5 kilo. So that's why RS is equal to 0. Point, sorry, 199.5 kilo ohms. If you observe any difference between the calculation of shunt resistance and this uh, calculation of series resistance, the calculation of shunt resistor values are in terms of only ohms, just ohms, not even kilo ohms. But here the series resistor RS is in terms of kilo ohms. <coughs> in uh, coming problems, you may have uh, hundreds, thousands of kilo ohms also, depending upon the usage of the voltage. My, uh, range okay, if it is 10 volts 20 volts the, like that it is only kilo ohms so if we are going for uh, maximum voltage ranges like a thousand volts then we have to go for the maximum register values like a kilo ohms to mega ohms okay you have to understand this difference coming to this sensitivity what do you mean by sensitivity sensitivity is defined as Sensitivity of an voltmeter is defined as it is proportional to 1 by full scale deflection current. Sensitivity is reciprocal to the full scale deflection current or meter current. S is equal to 1 by IFSD. So sensitivity and voltmeter range can be sensitivity of an voltmeter range can be calculated the multiplier resistance it is used to calculate the multiplier resistor rs of the dc voltmeter okay how see rs is equal to s into range minus rm how we have got this one how we have got this one see what is rs value previously we know the formula rs is equal to v by im minus rm i have given here s is equal to 1 by ifsd or im so if you substitute s is equal to 1 by ifsd here it becomes s is equal to 1 by m means s into v minus rm v is nothing but range v is nothing but range so in this way we have got here s into range minus rm 
<laughs> for example consider im is equal to 50 microamperes and rm is equal to 500 ohms range is equal to 10 volts like in the previous case same 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 formula we have taken same values we have taken but instead of directly giving a 1 by m here we have taken yes so sensitivity first we have calculated just 1 by m 20 kilo ohm per volt <coughs> ohm per volt 1 by ampere 1 by ampere you can write it as ohm per volt so sensitivity is given as 20 kilo ohm per volt so simply you can calculate the value as like this here also you will get the same just 1 by m is showing it as sensitivity sensitivity of any voltmeter is defined as the reciprocal to the meter current okay so thank you you will see the multi range voltmeter uh, how to construct the multi range voltmeter in shunt type and as well as series type as in the case of voltmeter uh, sorry as in the case of ammeter we will see that in the next lecture thank you <laughs>